So if you are asked to pick etomidate in your table viva, what are the important questions that can be asked? First, what is the mechanism of action of etomidate? Action of etomidate is by enhancing the activity of the GABA A receptors in the brain leading to CNS depression and anesthesia. Second, why is etomidate preferred in patients with cardiovascular instability? Etomidate is preferred in cardiovascular instability, especially in cases of myocardial dysfunction, shock, valvular heart disease, because it causes minimal changes in heart rate, stroke volume, and cardiac output. Third, what enzyme does etomidate inhibit, leading to adrenocortical suppression? The enzyme inhibited by etomidate is 11 beta hydroxylase, which is required in the adrenal gland to prepare cortisol. A single dose can inhibit this enzyme for almost up to 8 hours. Fourth, how is etomidate metabolized and eliminated from the body? The metabolism of etomidate is by hepatic and plasma esterases and it is excreted mainly via the urine, 85% of it and bile, 10% of it with less than 3% being excreted unchanged. Fifth, why does etomidate commonly cause myoclonus and how can this be prevented? Number 5. Etomidate causes myoclonus due to subcortical disinhibition of the motor pathways and this can be prevented by pre-medication with opioids like fentanyl, benzodiazepines or small doses of etomidate itself like 0.03 to 0.075 mg per kg. Sixth, what is the significance of etomidate's pharmacokinetic profile in clinical use? Number six, etomidate's pharmacokinetics supports rapid induction and rapid recovery from anesthesia. It has large volume of distribution. Most of it, 99% is unionized at physiological pH and it rapidly penetrates the brain. Its brief action is because of redistribution. Seven, how does etomidate affect the central nervous system, especially the intracranial pressure? Number seven, Etomidate reduces intracranial pressure by decreasing the cerebral blood flow and the CMRO2 that is the cerebral metabolic rate of oxygen consumption by 35 to 45%. And eighth important question, how does etomidate affect the respiratory system, especially the ventilations? Number eight, etomidate causes less respiratory depression as compared to other IV induction agents, but transient hypoventilation may occur. Now remember, if anyone asks you for the reference, you will say all this is from Stolting's Pharmacology.